My show is back on. The one y'all try to say I recorded and I watched it over and over and T-Voted. It. So it's on live right now. I'm going to do the video live for y'all. This fast forward button on the control. Y'all see, y'all know how the AT&T works. And do you see anything working? But you hear it going, right? My answer is paper copy filter as well. But I can pause it because it's live TV. Play it up, fast forward it up. So, here we go. Gold star, silver slipper, or mirror ball. So, we in the middle of the thing now. I'm not even answering these questions. Let's wait to the next one so we can get it done live. And y'all gonna know I'm the truth. on the British version. And why haven't you done it? Yeah. None of the female dance stars are prepared to risk the injury. <laughs> My 12 W's are considered a lethal weapon. All right, next question. Here we go. Once called the Fortunate Islands, which archipelago was named for the dogs living there? Aleutian Islands, Canary Islands, or Faroe Islands? Canary Islands? Gordon answers with Aleutian Islands. I thought of the, um, the, the I did it right, the dog race. Yep. And I, then my second thing was, is that an archipelago or not? I'm not sure. But if it is, then it's all coming together right there for me. Is the correct answer Aleutian Islands? Or the canaries. Or the canary dog. That's right. Raised canary by. Islands. $2,000 stays where it is. Here comes the beast. If you know your Latin, the Latin for dog is canis or canem. My answer is the Canary Islands. He doesn't think it's the answer. That's one. All right, next question. Let's move that money. If you enjoy the brooding, pale sexiness of Robert Pattinson's character in Twilight, you're most likely on which team? <laughs> team Jacob. Team Ryan or Team Edward? Team Edward? <laughs> I don't need, think y'all need help with that Martin one. answers with Team Edward. I have not seen Twilight, but the, the rivalry with him and the, the wolf boy is very famous. The wolf boy yes. is very famous. Yes. Is the correct answer Team Edward? Yeah, yeah. That's a gimme. of research I watched that film. Oh sure. Uh -huh. My answer is Team Edward. Next question. Which of these is not an element on the periodic table? Freon, fluorine, or samarium? Oh. Freon. Okay, Gordon, remember I told you you have to lock in within five seconds right. of one another. Otherwise, your answer is counted as wrong. Are we going to ask him what you would have pressed? I would have pressed Freon. Freon. Like antifreeze, like not an element. And the correct answer yep. is Freon. Oh, that money would have been in the bank. Right here. Oh, God, this guy's an My idiot. answer is Freon. And the I could have took his place. He's an idiot. Can we put that money in the bank? Let's find out with this next question. The name of what star in the constellation Orion means shoulder of the giant? Beetlejuice, Aldebaran, or Antares? Beetlejuice. Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice. Gordon answers with Beetlejuice. To put the $2,000 in the bank and send you to the final chase is the correct answer, Beetlejuice. Now, I'm not done yet. It's a good thing you went for the 
They just got this idiot right to the final round by him getting right there. Coach will tell you it doesn't matter how the leadoff man gets on base as long as they get on base. And that's the job you've done. Absolutely. Get him out of here. Bring somebody else up. Okay, this commercial. I'm just pausing for the commercial. Oh, yeah. Thank y'all for liking my videos and all that stuff. Uh, the commercials are still rolling on. Um, oh, yeah. Forget Manny Pacquiao and anybody that support him. Running up with me, that dumb stuff. You know, I actually had somebody tell me today that they read something that Manny Pacquiao, like Floyd Mayweather, with he's bigger than Manny Pacquiao and all that stuff. Stop with that. Floyd is 152. Manny weighed just about the same amount as him, 152. So cut that nonsense out. Manny Pacquiao, if you want to fight Floyd Mayweather, stop telling boxing scene and and all these other media press, get on the phone, tell Bob Arum right there live, go call Al Heyman and try to make the fight happen. Because if you don't call Al Heyman, how you making a fight, doofus? Okay, we back. Just to let you know it's live. Still there. Let me get rid of my straw. Dang. I don't want to get rid of that straw. Now, here's the thing. It's live. Y'all know it's live. So, all this I memorized the answer crap. It's coming to an end tonight. You're going to respect the king. Right now. The boy is gifted. If you win the money tonight, what would you like to do with it? I'd like to travel around the world with it if I can. Do something crazy I've never been, like Botswana or Live, Australia. Baby. One little bit of advice. If you travel to Australia, once you... See, I could pause it. You're outside the... Fast forward. Okay. Got it. Okay. okay. Take the butterfly swords. <laughs> you ready to do this? Yes, I'm I am. ready to Let's do this. Let's go. Because y'all just talking. Your time starts now. What fruit comes in varieties like Pippin and Red Delicious? Apple. Apple. Correct. What chemical company was founded in 1802 on the banks of the Brandywine? DuPont. Pass. DuPont Company. What colorful singer's 2013 The Truth About Love Tour was named for her album? Pink. Pink. Correct. What connective tissue comprises the skeletal system of sharks? That's cartilage. Correct. On June 28, 2000, what six-year-old boy did the U.S. force to return to Cuba? Elian Gonzalez Correct. case. What's the tallest volcano in Washington State? Rainier. Correct. Until 2012, Click and Clack hosted what public radio show for 25 years? Car Talk. Car Talk. What was the name of Linda Hamilton's character in the Terminator film series? Sarah Connor. Sarah Connor. Correct. Max goes on a strange adventure in what 1963 kids book by Maurice? Well, the wild things are. Correct. What was the real first name of baseball great Babe Ruth? George. Yes. George. Dennis Beer began with a 9,000-year lease on an unused brewery in what city? Dublin. Dublin. Correct. Boxes used to create the design in what traditional Indonesian cloth dye method? Didn't know. I don't know what she said. Didn't know that. <laughs> but look at that. Only missed two. Only missed two, baby. Give me, give me mine. Put me on this show. Do I need to do the beast one? I do the beast with. I do the ones with the beast for you. Just because we didn't went this far, we might as well go all the way. See if she All get the well, money. A very well earned forty thousand dollars that you earned in the cash builder. I I earned more than her forty grand. She didn't get nothing. I think I had about sixty, seventy grand in there. Twenty grand. Twenty grand. Or take a step closer to the beast, and he'll offer you. What you gonna offer her? Eighty grand. Eighty thousand dollars. I even got that right. Goodness Whoa. Christ. I want you back here. I'm going to tell you to bring us 20 grand right back here. Bring us 20 grand. You bring in 2,000 to the pot. And then you get to split split $45,000. You bringing two grand in? What do you think? It's tempting. Should super kick him right in the mouth. Of course she is. Caitlin, 
$20,000. The chase is on. All right, let's go. All right, first question. Who allegedly told U.S. Customs he had nothing to declare but his genius? John Lennon, Oscar Wilde, or Simon Cowell? Where is me? Or Beast. <laughs> Caitlin answers with? Oscar Wilde. Oscar Wilde. Do you know I don't know this. Um, I don't know, it just seems like something he would have said. All right. Is the correct answer Oscar Wilde? Yes! I guess. I don't know that one. Answers with Oscar Wilde. But I actually know this quote because I steal it all the time. <laughs> Next question. What spider lives underwater by trapping an air bubble in its web and using it to breathe? Lake bottom spider? Diving bell spider or submarine spider? It's the lake bottom. Caitlin says. No, the diving bell spider. Diving bell spider. Yep. Why? This was the first thing that looked good to me. I feel like I might have heard of that spider and not sure the other ones. Is diving bell spider correct? Yep. Yes, it is. It definitely is the diving bell spider. Beasting. Purely because I thought naming animals tended to be a bit earlier and probably predated submarine my answer is diving bell spider all right next question if kim has a 20 liter can and chloe has a 10 gallon can who's got the bigger can kim has the bigger can chloe has the bigger can or their cans are the same size I'm guessing, is this some reference to... <laughs> Please. They both locked in. Caitlin answers with... Kim. Kim has the bigger can. Kim Kardashian. Let's see if Kim has the bigger can. Can move that money? <laughs> when we come back. Now, nah, I wasn't expecting this. A commercial? A lot of people say... You hate Manny Pacquiao because he's Filipino. I don't hate Manny Pacquiao. I just think he's a stupid fighter. And he fights a very dumb fight. And he can't fight to me. To, to me, he's... Watching Manny Pacquiao fight is like watching two people outside just try to throw him. I might as well go to World Star Hip Hop and watch people just throw their hands. Oh, I don't know what commercial this is. Hydroxy cut. Oh my god, and they just got this little thick girl out here and just flashing her boobies. What in the world is Hydroxy cut doing? Miss Texas. Oh, she done lost 30 pounds. She looked better before she lost the weight. Should have left that Hydroxy medicine and all that garbage alone. All right, we're back to the show. I don't even know why I'm continuing this thing. Back out. We're looking for what's bigger, the 20 liter can or a 10 gallon can. I'm going with Kim Kardashian. Kim has the bigger can. Is Kim has the bigger can correct? Nope, it's Chloe. No, Chloe has the bigger can. $40,000 stays where it is. Beast. My answer is Chloe has the bigger can. Ah, of course, on the math question. Let's move that money with this question. Which of these Denzel Washington movies is set farthest from Washington, D.C.? Cry Freedom, Much Ado About Nothing, or Training Day? Cry Freedom. Caitlin answers with... Training Day. Why? I think that was set in Los Angeles. That's almost 3,000 miles from D.C. Do you know where the other two are set? I have no idea. No idea. <laughs> okay. Is the correct answer training day? No. Cry freedom. And the beast answered with? Cry freedom. And the beast is right behind us now on the board. 
Cry Freedom, um, he played Bantu Stephen Biko, the yep. uh, black South African activist who died under very suspicious circumstances while in police custody. Okay, you have to get the next one right, because if we don't, and he does, that's it. We have to say goodbye to the $40,000, and unfortunately, you won't be moving on to the final chase. Yeah. Let's move that $40,000 with this next question. In 1559, King Henry II of France was fatally injured while participating in which activity? Jousting, archery, or eating breakfast? Uh, Caitlin answers Jousting. With, jousting. To move the $40,000 away from the beast. Is the correct answer jousting? I'm rolling. It really was a death knell of this particular sport. Armored knights were now getting cut to pieces by gunpowder weapons. Oh, and English and Welsh archers, of course. My answer is jousting. You've got to keep it moving. Let's do it with this next question. Often called the world's smallest army, the Swiss Guard.